All right, what's up ladies and gentlemen, it's Super here and welcome to another Mortal Kombat 1 video and I just got done playing with one absolutely gorgeous skin and I'm moving to another. I just got done playing with UMK3 Ermac, human form, and now I'm playing with the 1995 movie Scorpion skin. You seem reasonable. Stand down or die. Get out of here. <laughs> I've never heard that before. But leave a thumbs up on the video for the absolutely gorgeous, amazing Mortal Kombat movie skin. Sorry, I'm like concentrating here. I got Pharaoh with me. Hello. Uh, uh. Ah, damn it. Dropped it. Ah, really? I thought I was going to be uh, so smart trip guarding him with that, but let me know what you guys think of this skin. I think it looks absolutely gorgeous. Pretty much identical to the movie. Whoa. Shit. Gotta break that shit. Ooh. You know what? I don't even need to use my uh, Fatal Blow right there. I love using Pharah, man. Pharah is so cool. I love the fact that she just gives you straight up mix-ups. Nice. Get over here! The only bad thing, her cooldown time is pretty, pretty long. Gotta establish that a little bit. I'll just keep it simple. Simple is still a 30% uh, combo. Oh, that's not a low, is it? Ah, <laughs> oh, I got clipped by the overhead for some reason. He could easily make this comeback. Nice. Not anymore, though. Hold up. I don't know how, but I somehow remembered. And the first match that we play with this absolutely gorgeous skin that's free from WB and Netherrealm Studio. Huge W for giving us the skin for free. Is I get a nice Hellfire brutality. Doesn't get any better than that. Like I said, I'm loving these mix-ups. It actually gives Scorpion a little bit of a mix-up game here. Ouch. Nice up block. He fucked up the punish, though. I think he's like, wait a minute. I actually hit the up block? <laughs> That's uh, that's a really good way to keep Omni Man's forward three safe for the most part, unless you meter burn, just like that. I'll do the low. Farah does recover really, really slow. So even though you are getting your mix-ups, well, actually it doesn't recover like too slow. Oh fuck! She doesn't recover too slow. Compared to some characters like Goro, they actually nerf Goro's, they nerf Goro's damage, and now he just recovers super slow. Yeah, he still does a lot of damage if you want to go the uh, punch walk route, but he was doing like insane damage before. Ah, fuck! I dropped my stand one. Oh, I was actually going in for pressing a button. By the way, I could get a ton of damage with uh, Fair and Scorpion if I do the pain and gain like in the middle or uh, full screen, and I get my two pain and gains. Not gonna try right now. Only at an appropriate time. 
Nice block. Ah, oh, man, that fucking jump three. Wait. Oh my god, not like this. Alright, that that worked. That works out for me. Oh, I didn't have any, um... I didn't... I did have meter. Why didn't I get my... Uh, jump up spear. I was about to say, we're gonna get brutalities in back-to-back -back games, but I think Ed Boon was saying that the universe would explode with hype if I got brutalities in back-to-back -back games. So that means I have to get a brutality in this game for to make up for it. Oh shit, he actually That's actually not a true block string. So if I do 2 1 in a Pharaoh, that's actually you could interrupt that with just a regular basic stand one attack. Damn, that was a fuck ton of damage. But I do have to establish some other options in order to make that mix up possible and so you won't interrupt it. Oh no, I did not want to do that. That was an accident. Escape failed. That was not on purpose. I was doing forward three. Oh crap, why am I ducking? That is so stupid. There's no mix up in that situation. There was no reason for me to duck. Obviously his dive bomb was going to be safe because of the onion rings. But there is no reason for me to get hit by that. Put myself in the corner for a little bit of extra damage. Nice little back dash for Scorpion. Mix up the combo a little bit. Oh, I was going for the raw dog right there. Oh, the Ultra Instinct came in. He activated Ultra Instinct at the perfect time, me trying to press buttons. I do love the fact that you could combo back three into low Farah or overhead Farah from almost full screen. Yeah, keeping keeping it safe. Look, see? Uh, am I gonna get it? No. That's why it's uh, in many ways, it's better to just keep it keep it simple. He could armor through that. I'm pretty. He he did armor through it before, but I don't think he wants to use up his armor on that. I think it's better just to keep it safe and stay with something like this instead of going for the forward three uh, two knee. Oh, let's go. That's even better. No wonder Ed Boon didn't want me to get the Brutality in the last match because we were going to get one that was so much better. Hitting a combo into the down, down, down. Hellfire Spear Brutality. That's what I'm talking about. 1995 movie Scorpion representing, baby. That was a weird scenario right there. I actually hits uh, Sonya. Like I said, I'm loving Farah. Give Scorpion a little bit more offense than he normally would have. Gotta be careful, because that second hit is an overhead. Ooh, nice. Am I going to be able to finish it here? Oh, he flawless blocked it. Oh, no. Ugh! I was just mashing my li for my life right there. I cannot believe that he was left with the magic pixel. 
Ooh, what a micro duck and a half that was. Yeah, this is like 44, 42. Ah, it's a little bit too late on that. That's why I just do jump four, jump three, or jump two. That was definitely <laughs> not expected, but. Oh no! Oh, that was my chance to get crazy ass damage. Fuck. I forgot that I just have to do a jump immediately. Man, that was my chance. Not only did I blow my double pain and gain chance in order to get some huge damage, I lost the fucking round, <laughs> which is the worst part of it. Oh, I got the hit confirmed though. He probably thought I was going to go for a grab or something. Imagine he would have micro ducked me. Oh my god, he got me again. <laughs> he got me again. Oh, he fucked up though. There you go. We got it this time. Look at that damage. That's really good damage for a full screen low. Oh my god, I thought he was going to go in for his stance. Yes, got him this time. Shit. <laughs> I didn't know what to do afterwards. I was just sort of improvising combos. Because I didn't really practice too much um, with Scorpion and Ermac. Because I have a little trip that I'm going on little business that I'm doing uh, so I'm not gonna be here so I'm like let me just play Scorpion normally the way I play Takeda with Pharah which is a lot of just mix-ups obviously I can't get the same combos that I can with Takeda because Takeda just has some of the coolest combos but I'm pretty much playing Scorpion the way I normally play him just that with the the Pharah mix-ups ah oh, come on I press stand one two that's why I'm just playing like one set because normally I would have moved on because I did win. I think I won three in a row. I'm not sure. But I'm just playing one set per character. Trying to get some footage for you guys. We did get some brutality, so I'm happy about that already. Oh my god, raw ass, uh, raw ass legs, raw ass Sonia. Yeah, that was a bad clap right there, friend. I don't want it. Oh, shit. He blocked it. Oh, no. He fucked up. He fucked up big time. I don't know what he tried to do right there. He, oh, you know what? I know what he tried to do. He tried to do instant dive bomb because he saw that the onion ring hit me and he might be able to combo into it if he did the instant dive bomb. So then he would have been able to combo the onion ring because it hit late. The onion ring into the dive bomb and then that would have granted him a full combo. Oh, look at this damage, guys. Woo! 540 damage! 540 damage with the pain and gain, baby. Oh, I love Farah. I love Farah. All right, let's play one more match, win or lose. I fucking love Farah so much, guys. The double pain and gain is actually pretty viable if someone is impatient because... It does take 15% away from you because the first pain and gain takes away five. And then if you want to stack it, 
The second pain and gain is 10, but obviously the combination of the two leads to 15% damage that you inflict on yourself. But if the other player is maybe a little impatient, or they think they could get a setup going, and they hit your pain and gain armor while Ferris coming out, dude, you are getting absolutely insane damage with any character. I even kept it simple right there, making sure I don't drop in. Yeah, it's plus on block. The overhead one is plus on block. The one where he jumps. Ah, oh, shit. You can't fuck with Johnny's jump three. That shit wasn't Evo, ladies and gentlemen. You gotta up block that. Ah. Oh. oh my god. American reset. Breaker? Yep. Oh gosh. Okay. I can't believe I got hit by that. Can you? That's what I wanted to do right there. Oh, he went with the low option this time. Yeah, I think he learned his lesson not to get hit full screen by Farah. <laughs> oh my god, what a jump. Johnny Cages are psychic when it comes to jumps. Oh, that was cool. Damn, right when I was going to press a button. Oh, it's so beautiful that you can't hold that anymore. That used to be such an annoying wake-up to defend against. Yeah, it should do it here. Damage! Look at that. Meterless damage off of a Pharah overhead that's plus on block. Shit. Got me with the jump. All right, we'll do this. If he beats me, we'll play one more because I don't want to leave after him beating me once. He's going to be like, man, you didn't even give me a chance to play some more with Johnny. Oh, no. American reset, ladies and gentlemen. Yes. Get him with that for now. Alright. There's regenerating. It's gonna take her a bit though. Oh my god, the micro duck. Not even he thought he was gonna connect on that. Oh! Wrong button, super. Wrong button. No, he knew it. He knew it. That was a good read. That was a good read. I'll give it to him. He knew that I was going to go for the grab. He knew it. Because you, you, I know that he knew it because he micro-ducked it and immediately punished. Ah, I should have gone for the forward three in that situation. All right, since he did beat me, I don't want to be like, all right, you beat me once, so I'm leaving. Or... You know, if I beat him this next one, I'll be like, uh, I'll give him another rematch. We'll make it a first two out of three. Shit. If he beats me here, though, then we're fucked. <laughs> Sick combo, right? Did some good damage, too. I don't want it to not punch. Ooh, I was just out of range. How much is this gonna do? It was just one pain in game. 
shit. I gotta start using my... Oh my god, this is gonna be a lot of fucking damage. I gotta start using my forward three more. I gotta use my forward three four. Because that's the uh, safe version. You can't duck that one. Oh god, that was a lot of damage. No! I was ducking too. I just got up too fast. Oh, by the way, I just noticed that we're playing jo oh, fuck. We're playing Johnny versus Scorpion. The iconic movie matchup. Nice. Gotta use a raw sometimes. Gotta go raw sometimes, right? Oh, backdash into. I didn't know if you could interrupt that. I just did it. Oh God. Ooh. <laughs> oh, good thing I immediately did stand one because he could have micro ducked that. I'm gonna keep him here in the corner. I'm right, making these reads now. Ooh. Now I'm making these correct decisions on when he's going to press buttons. Oh my god, I flinched. I was blocking the correct way. Shit. Why am I trying to press buttons? Oh, that went below. He got me, guys. Oh my god. I cannot believe I got away with that. Scorpion is a fan of Johnny Cage, so I think he should want to spend some more time in the battlefield. If you guys watch the Mortal Kombat movie, yeah, he's pissed. He's like, I can't believe that just happened. Johnny Cage actually has, or Scorpion inside his body actually has a signed copy of Johnny Cage's autograph. <laughs> or signed copy of uh, Johnny Cage's uh, headshot, like a picture. That shit is so funny. Alright, let's go. Good armor through that. Oh, I could have actually punished that. That shit is punishable. It used to not be punishable, but it's punishable now. Like I said, I'm starting to make some of these better reads on when he's going to press buttons and when he's not. Nice. I will take all that damage. Thank you very much. Yes. Counter poke with my armor. Woo! Let's go, Scorpion. Bring that shit back. Oh my god, I didn't think he would go full on overhead. Hello? Trying to micro duck me again, sir? Ooh, just missed. All right, I'll take that. I actually want to reset him. 
Oh my god. I can't. It's too close. That was actually a bad decision for me to go for that specific. Come on. Ah, it was a bad decision for me to go to to the overhead because there was no mix up with the overhead. I should have gone with the low. It actually would have done more damage because he up locked. Crunch time. Nice. Oh, nice punish. Oh, why did I try to wake up buttons? That's gonna be too much damage. Damn, he was that close! I just broke for nothing. Come on, please tell me this is gonna do it. That'll be the perfect conclusion. Yeah, that's definitely gonna do it. And what wins me the game, ladies and gentlemen? Something that Scorpion doesn't naturally have, which is 50-50. Yakuza drop. Lin Kuei drop for the win. Yes. Ugh. That was a hard fought set right there. Especially the, uh, the Johnny Cage versus Scorpion were definitely some hard fought matches, but that's gonna do it ladies and gentlemen we played a really long set i actually did not expect to play this long of a set versus this guy but you know when he switched to johnny cage i wanted to make sure i gave him at least more than one match you know for him to just make sure that if he did beat my ass again you know it was, it was gonna be deci a decisive two three victory uh two out of three victory for him but luckily i was able to bring him back and yeah i, I hit a 540 damage combo and i gave scorpion some much needed mix-ups that he doesn't normally have with Farah overhead low yeah some some combo strings are not true block strings meaning you could interrupt it but that's when you continue your whole combo string 214 or you do 2-1 in a down one uh you have to establish the fact that your opponent has to respect you but once you establish that excuse me once you establish that, you're going to be able to mix your opponent up with overhead and lows. And that's what you guys saw there. I can't wait to play more Pharaoh with some of these other characters. Um, because I've only been playing Takeda. And as fun as Takeda is, uh, Pharaoh giving some of these other characters like Scorpion something they don't have, which is mix-ups, is really, really nice. So that's it for me. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I will see you guys next time. What's going on? It's Super here and thank you guys so much for watching today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did and you aren't subscribed already, make sure you guys do so. And if you want to see some more, there's videos popping up on the screen right now. So thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time.